Hello there. That's a carbon steel knife. It's all grounded and polished to a desired degree, which is a satin finish in this case. To acid edge, uh, you need to clean it with a alcohol-based solution or just simply rubbing alcohol to get rid of all the fingerprints and all the grease on it to be sure that the acid is contacting it all the time. Once it's done, I put a hook because this is hot water. This is a dirty water, but it's simply water. And this is the ferric chloride, the acid in this case. We're gonna put uh, some baking powder in the water to make it an alkaline solution to stop the alcohol function when we want to. So to start with, we start with the acid. Get a cloth ready. Dip into the water and immediately into the baking powder and hot water mix to stop the acid. Now that's the first run. It's already taking an edge as you can see. And carry on like this to a desired degree of edge. I'll just go two more times and I, it should be enough. water, get the excess and bicarbonate and hot water solution and rub it clean again. Back into the acid. <clears throat> again, normal water, bicarbonate and rub it clean in straight stroking motions. As shown. You don't want to rub it round or in a dispersed motion because the acid will have a pattern on it. So you want a straight lines, nearly invisible. In this case, I'm going to put, uh, leave it here a little bit more because I want a darker edge on my knife. Water and the same drill. And rub it. Not the rabbit, <laughs> not the rabbit animal. Rub it. and WD-40 or any engine oil to stop it uh, actually to prevent the contact of it with air at least about 12 hours I leave it overnight it should be enough and after 12 hours or overnight it will stay like this, dark and etched. Thank you for watching.